Kyler. It's been a slight delay. Oh. We're utilizing the time we have now to get the troops in position. We'll be catching up with the majority of them. However, the barons have specifically requested the presence of the nobility for this morning's fight. It's a good showing for their mother. We'll have to attend. <sighs> right. As soon as it's done, we'll leave. <clears throat> Let's start heading over there now. I'll change into my good clothes. A good idea. Fuck you, Marcus! The fights this morning as per the barons. They want a good showing of the new building in front of their mother. Once that's done, we'll depart for the mines at once. Right on. Oh, get on, my nap. How's your sleep? Restful. Ah, good. My lord, good morning. Morning. Whew. I'll, I'll catch up. Something on your mind. <clears throat> Aside from the obvious. Aside from the obvious. Not really. Still just kind of... I don't know. I'll go up above. Take care of my obligations. As soon as we say hellos. Separate yourself down below and round up our loyal. Be ready to depart. Yeah. <clears throat> we staying to watch the fights or just popping in? I would like us to be there to watch the fights, but we'll leave halfway through. Understood. I'm alone. <clears throat> I have no care for the blood sport. Yeah. Kyle of Phila and Sir Halstead. I didn't even you know. recognize him. My <laughs> lords. <clears throat> We're going to be delayed a little bit on the mine attack. We've been requested to attend to the fights this morning. <clears throat> We're going to go there, show our face, leave about halfway through. I say. Very well. I feel a lot safer now. Hi. <laughs> <Aye. clears throat> Feeling is mutual. Uh. Looking good, man. Uh, feels just right. A little tight here and there, but you found an artifact. Oh, okay. I took the one you had, Marcus. Lord gave permission I don't for it. Suppose you've seen Marco, have you? Hmm. No, not in the slightest. You need him for something? No, not at the moment. If you get across to him, let him know I'm looking for him. I can wait till the afternoon. 
Of course. All your coin into uh, the champagne. <laughs> beyond the slave Sahib, you lie an even greater prize. The vineyard beyond, of which machinations are already in place. The cogs slowly turn, and your meeting with the young Master Jean awaits you day after. The clatter of Baron, plates Baroness, throws you from morning. your thoughts. I hope the day it finds fine. you well. Yes, it, it does. Will. Thankfully. <coughs> Excellent. It has been far too long since I have found myself down here watching. <coughs> I'm sure the people will be in good spirits seeing you out and about, my lady. If you're at will. I should hope so. It's not every day that my mother has been able to grace the town with her presence. <clears throat> Thought we would have been here already. <clears throat> they seem to make it a precedent at this point, either for <clears throat> attention. Or what? Who knows? Hopefully, the fights will be entertaining today. Aye. Okay, I have no doubt they will be. See, I fucking told you, get fucking wankies, get over here. Boys. <coughs> <coughs> Before you even fight, she can't even control her own stuff. Oh, you're on that side, ain't you? I'm gonna be on that side. It doesn't matter. Hey, Direct like reflection over there. of this side. the Lady Knowles. Us. No, we're over here. <laughs> we're over here. The Lady Knowles. She's fucking old. Yes. Jesus. Thank you, sir. I remember it's a sharp at this game. The Lady Knowles boys know what they do. Either way, it doesn't matter much. And heavily distracted, it seems. For those of you in town, an announcement would go through via town criers that the fights are about to begin. Alright. Trying to remember, what was it? You can't even afford a task. Is it three or four hours, hours, it seems, today? Aye. I thought it was the team. I mentioned the Look at the Keep walking. Yes. Muzz. My apologies, gods. Lord Muzz. We know this so well. Muzz Gondor. The fuck are you doing on this side, mate? Go to your fucking side. 
That's Nozus You can walk side. across. Only Nozus' slaves belong oh, to the Nozus. Her from Nozus herself. Hey. I'm sure you'll be glad so to we're learn. So we're on the same side. I decided to change up our schedule. We're all gonna spread out when we get up. Baroness's enjoyment. Excuse me. You changed my arena. I believe it would be more entertaining if, uh, an underdog were to, uh, participate. As opposed to the reigning champion himself. Oh, alright all right, then. I'm with you. Oh, alright. Okay. And who has signed no, off on this? Ah. Fuck it, sure. No, you do the uh, original squad, no? Do your thing. I'm talking now. I hope you don't mind, Lady Nozos. I just thought a little variety might do us some good. No, my Baron, of course. My apologies. I should have known better. No apologies needed. I apologize for not consulting you for first. No. It is your fight, your arenas. I just oversee them. See, so he, the right we idea. knew that the lady knows us would understand. Oh, slave. <laughs> None of us are I'm Nozus quite understanding. Slave. Actually, I don't. Like you like a strange time to recover. <laughs> like, like well, he was gonna lose his last fight. And yeah, we're all over here. <laughs> 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 So is there like a special wood there that like Excuse me, I do need to go down it or something? What's so special about that side? Well, Nozos is the arena master, <laughs> so... Her property, she chooses what to do with. You want to have him up there? Including me? Sure. I mean, I climbed down there just to see. Test my luck. No splinter, so... I think that side actually gets whacked. I think they say it's just part of the power fantasy. Probably. Where? Oh, Best of luck, new blood. Hope you last long. <coughs> Picking music is hard. I'll be trying. Now what? She's gonna. Ah, the young lord is here as well. Pleasure. Pleasure. Are you gonna be betting on the fights today? Not today. I'm not really one for betting on fights, more so the tournament was what I was interested in. My bear. Murdered heart? Where the fuck am I gonna watch this? Where the. Where am I gonna watch this? The city's divided. If you are observing the fight, please move to arena chat. Thank you. We risk much, but such is the Grodian way. No risk, no wager, no reward. The uh, fights today, I believe, are starting with a four on four. <laughs> Something we haven't seen in quite some time. I was gonna say, it's been a while. Uh, no. I've seen Drench fight yeah, four people, but never four and four. So fun and everywhere. It's hilarious. <sighs> ready? Alright. <laughs> Purple's on the right side. Do forgive me, my Baroness, for being All so right. late. Right. <laughs> Not at all. It seems we were too early. <laughs> no, no. Sometimes things just so seem to be set in right. order. My apologies for not having Good them in time. Let's go, macho. Open the gates! Let them in! Go time. Go time. You know the music. It's time to dance, huh? <laughs> we got this. Hold on. My <coughs> guard, open the gates! Yeah. Open the gate. I am worried. Open the gate. Kind of fun. Opening the gate. Mm -hmm. 
fuck did a big hole get in here? What the? Uh, <sighs> there they are. Oh. <laughs> it seems your slaves Closing are losing the discipline gate. to you, Lady Nozos. These are not mine. Only one. Only the one on the right. I assure you, he can put on a show. Hmm. Just we'll see. see. None of them look that special to me. Hmm. As you all observe, you'll see a number of gladiators all file into the arena. All are lightly armored with wicked looking weapons ready to fight to the yield. Those that are standing below seem prepared, each willing to try and bring home glory for oneself. They look up to those who have arranged their fight, <clears throat> waiting the word. And two. The gifts. The gladiators turn and look towards the barons and baroness, their weapons holding high, waiting for the Please signal to be excited. given. They seem too eager. Lady Nolzis drops her arm, and the fight good. begins. Apparently I was too eager. One is a new slave, is he not? Which? The one to the left. It was the fool. Hmm. He's one of Mama's. Did you not hear about his loss? In very quick succession, Vakir begins fighting with one of the horned gladiators. A kick to the nether sends him down to the ground. However, he recovers quickly. And with his blade, freedom. he will begin slashing wildly at the <laughs> currently unarmed gladiator. The stupidity of it all. Mm. Quite. <laughs> Do me a favor, my son. Go down below with Sir Brooker and make sure our people are ready to move, including <clears> the <throat> soldiers. With me. That's my lord. Oh, maybe yes. Are they all yours? I know my baron. I assure you. Morning, Jack. All can see with a critical one that the horned gladiator suddenly feel. overwhelms Vakir, kicking him backwards against the dirt. He goes falling back, sprawled on his back. The gladiator begins stepping over him and delivers a to be critical staged? slash across his chest. Well, if we gather people <clears throat> probably outside the arena, most of our regular we're gonna be fighters headed down. Blood sprays yeah. across the sand. However, one of his All teammates right. quickly kicks him mm. off, and Vakir is able <clears> to <throat> temporarily to continue them. fighting. I don't know which Redoubt soldiers are with us. Um, let's see. Now we can ask. This isn't exactly a clandestine operation. Mm. Oh, right. The sword. <laughs> Morning, gentlemen. Uh, However... As the gladiator goes to throw his sword, with a natural 20, Bakir rolls under it, 
and you. quickly grabs the gladiator by his horned helmet and throws him face first into the agent. sand, grabbing him by the neck and giving it a almost fatal snap. He goes limp, at the very least unconscious. Hope he knows it's through the you. Are you joining us on the expedition this morning? <coughs> Caught wind of it. Triggers a cherry can for the already been picked. <coughs> but what I know. Vakir begins brutally <laughs> mauling the plumed helmed gladiator. He begins knocking him to the ground, tackling him down. <coughs> I think there's a certain team that's losing. What gave it away? I'm not sure if there's any losing anymore. <laughs> the fuck, three of them are on their asses. So They've got three that have passed. Seems a bit one sided. Got back up. One's by himself. So I think purple is losing. You know, that would actually be mostly, probably, right? Because they're over there. <laughs> One. Purple and gold scarves, huh? Purple sky mess. Interesting. <clears throat> the team fight devolves into a 1v3. However, the red haired gladiator with the maze seems to pair off with the purple, and they begin to exchange fierce blows. I'm gonna change into my armor. <clears throat> hmm. I did not expect my armor to be reshaped so soon. Not getting jealous, are we? Ah, <sighs> uh, no. It just—I guess it had sentimental value. So I'm—I'm I'm glad it's put to better use, though. I have no idea where these people are supposed to be. <clears throat> I don't know how I'm supposed to look for them. <laughs> Most of the, the usual people we bring on this stuff are out of town. <clears throat> or not here. I don't know where these Redoard soldiers are staged. Be right back. Is ready. Aye. Good. <sighs> Have our horses and check back in with the arena. Yep. Let's walk there. I'm just going to need his horse, too. Right. <clears throat> we don't want to give the game away. Okay. 
this time the first fight should be done. I noticed um, Sir Halstead doesn't wear um, the colors. I don't recognize them. Uh, he's not our knight. He hasn't sworn to us yet. Oh, okay. That's what you meant. Yes. Um, <clears throat> which house is it? Not sure. I don't think it is huh. a house. Hmm. Maroon just... and white. Hmm. Good fight. Thanks. <laughs> How big the champion is. I'm pretty sure he could, you know, just smack you with it and he'd go to the other side of the arena. Or someone could challenge him. Most likely. Are they pl placing the bet? You need help actually no, really, out, possibly. I don't place Leave bets for murdering, Never. killing, or school. Just one of those no. days. <clears throat> now, where I place my money is on getting food and supplies. Oh, <laughs> step <laughs> two. <laughs> well trained <laughs> fighters. <laughs> one of them, his skin <laughs> pale. <laughs> And the people oh, of Nautis right. would recognize him as the albino who oh, raises his oh, sword and looks to the crowd for oh, goodness, approval. Goodness, he's got some nice Gladiators as much a performance <laughs> art as anything. Skin, so. <clears throat> the two warriors <laughs> look up towards the fans, towards Good morning. Mm -hmm. and the nobles mm -hmm. and the baron. Yes, and that is when it's pause. Al almost as pause. Everyone would bear witness that the arena begins to fill with smoke. It fulminates from untold areas and begins to obscure the view rather quickly. It begins to choke the breathing of all present. There are sounds, the scraping of iron, the unsheathing of blades, perhaps, and the sound of struggles begin to be heard. And as the smoke begins to clear, all of you would see that the gladiators that were in the pit have disappeared. And there's now the sound of struggle from above. As up in the crowd by the nobles, there's the sound of murder and screams. On pause. Up to the Baroness. Oh god, what's happening? Oh shit! <laughs> From behind. To your side. Take that one! Oh, Just punch fuck. him down. There's more in the crowd! There's so many in the crowd! Fuck's sake. Marcus! Next, our caught nobles are chased off before being cut down. Cries from the Lord Earhart and his knights and retinue begin to sound from the battlements of the keep above. The ring of the champion's anchor can be heard as one of the warriors <laughs> from behind is attacking the, the nobles is sent over the barricade. Drop it! <laughs> He's gonna jump on your back and he's gonna wrap his arm around your neck and hold you. Stupid <laughs> leg. Turn around. Turn around. Turn around. 
As this chaos is taking place, a singular command is yelled out. The command echoes across Get the, the civilians out. The arena. Pause. Pause. At this time, the remaining assailants, everyone near them, will hear a ping as several dozen flash powders go off, bonding everybody either up by the nobles or down in the stands, sending the defenders reeling. The sound of scrabbling over wood and the remaining assailants are heard as their feet echo heading towards the woods. When the flash powder dissipates, there is no sight of your attackers, but those you have killed and the blood that you have spilled. Unpause! Resume. My lord, are you right? I'm good. Okay. We need to get the people out of here. Gather the wounded. Get them to the quickly as they clinic. Appeared. They're gone. Right. Are you alright? Are you alright? Are you home? Where are they? We took off into the woods. The forest. The god. The forest. Yes. Sergeant. Mobilize the QRF. What happened? Uh, planned attack. Get the wounded to the clinic. Uh, fuck. Vacate the arena. The arena is closed. Vacate the arena now. You may all return to your appropriate channels. <clears throat> The Baroness. You heard him make it happen. The Baroness has given us orders, and the Air Hearts will follow the orders as we were given. Now move! Get him to the town, come on. As you say. Let's go. That's where I'm heading. That's where they're I don't know, some kind of. What are you standing there, soldier? Move! Yes, sir. I'll get one of the horses. The Lord ordered all right, I believe. My lord, you okay? Yeah, some fun. What the fuck was that? I have no idea. Guards are conducting a sweep through the city. Nowhere. I've mobilized the QRF to scan the outside. I don't know if we'll find anything, but... Good. We have two dead nobles have their throats slit quite expertly, I must say. Who did we oh lose? One of the ministers of commerce, and the other one was in charge of the import and export of slaves in this part of the province. Nothing that'll cripple us. I don't know if that was the target or not. That fight that they all by now. Wasn't that supposed to be your fight? The Baroness? We should vacate with the others. I already had them escorted back to the keep along with the Baron. Those are sort to it. Okay. Open the gate! There's a body down here! I don't know what the hell is going on. Sabrooka. The fact that. Open the way. Down below. Hit that lever. We're opening the lever, Guardsman! Thank you! Check on Sir Halstead, he took a fucking flash powder right to the eyes. Understood. Stay by your side. Fucking shit. In case they can come back and it's not. Are you alright, my lord? I'm alright. Thank you. Almost took one of those bastards alive. They made a charge for the nobles. Is that the target? as much as Paul? It's hard to say. 
They attacked all the guards within the arena, and then the nobles themselves. But they weren't close enough to Do get have... to. Uh, at least to the baron. Any witnesses? Know what they look like? <clears throat> Masked. Clouded. Covered. Yeah. Oh, fuck. They me. took off into the woods. <clears throat> Yeah, of course they fucking did. I have men searching the town now. Get the QR <sighs> friend. Organize. Do a roaming patrol. Six men. Make way. Exactly what the Lord. Good, Fenton. Teams. Take your horses a little that way. Not too far to the horses. Or not too far down there. We got orcs. You know what you're looking for. Got it. I'll be hunting. <sighs> He'll be alright. He's one of the best <clears throat> on those horses that I know. <sighs> How are your eyes? Full search bits on. You look at their bloodshot. I'm right here. Look for anyone with wounds or blood on them. Obvious signs of battle. We'll do. I'll go find up these. Really too close. Go on. Sir, I'll be around town as well. The north gate has been sealed. They're going from ta from town to town, or cool. well, from uh, from building yes. to building, searching for anyone, any clues, any descriptions. So far, nothing. I counted, uh, five anyone Shall looks for anyone looks like they've been in battle. Blood on them. We've been looking for tears. We're going to yes. keep ourselves cool and protective here, and then we're going to gather up. Uh, who they should come to in case they find suspicious peoples. <laughs> they can come to me for now. Either the, the sergeants or us. Excuse us. Of course, the lady knows us. Yes, Sergeant. <sighs> Where did Meanwhile, you check the camps? anyone in out of town? Are we on lockdown? For now, yes. Very good. We will be checking the camps and then returning for the lockdown. I believe that is fair, yes? Absolutely. Be safe. Mm. Watch out for a dredge. You too. <sighs> that all happened way too fast. It was clearly planned. Oh, dozens of men dead. How many nobles lost their lives? Just one. I heard a couple. Just one? Uh, Negative. two. Between you and me, two. But let's not spread that around too much. Mm. <clears throat> That's something I have to report mm. later. Fuck. The trade minister and the person in charge of the trade and import of slaves. Hello targets, huh? They knew what they were doing. targets or were they casualties? Just merely in the world. Wasn't... Those are two very important huh? positions. Why would you waste your sneak attack on someone you're not intending to kill? I think if it wasn't for all of you, they would have got more. Either way, this looks bad for us. But thank you. Yeah. All right. You did your best. We'll figure it out, huh? Yeah. Let me know if anything changes. I will do. Let's take a jaunt around town, see if anything pops up, you two. Oh. Yes, my lord, you leave. As you this one says yes. they maybe spotted some of the attackers and have a description no, for us. No, no, no. I was in the middle of the fight in the arena. That's what I'm saying. Anything would help. There. Please. Any descriptors? They were right next to us when it happened. I saw one of the guards get cut down by these guys. They were wearing, I think, leathers. The smoke was hard to see. One of and them had a mask. Ran towards the woods. More I'll come by later, Stefano. Mm -hmm. Unless you can identify one's face. <clears throat> Got them? Okay. Knight? Lord Anhart. <sighs> Any idea what that attack was? We're still looking into it. When there's stuff we can talk about that we can say, we'll obviously tell people. Right now, we just don't want to say Gosh. things we don't understand. <clears throat> you suppose the town should be locked down a little bit, or do you think it's safe to walk the streets? The town is on lockdown. No one's leaving the city. 
Have them stay in the bathhouse if they're worried. The guards are going building to building, so if they come in, cooperate. Of course. Good morning. Check the house if you would, one of you. Make sure no foul play. <clears throat> if you would, Marcus. Uh, thank Sergeant. Morton. May I ask what is going on? There was a planned attack at the arena this morning. People in the crowds and people up with the nobles. I see. That explains all the yelling and banging in the cross town. Your clinic will be a little full for a little bit while people get treated. I hope that's okay. Well, the clinic's there to serve. The clinic staff will take care of it, I'm sure. Appreciate it. If you haven't seen any masked figures that look like assassins, do let me know. Understood. Thoughts? The steps Best here. Bat. Thank you. Hard to say for sure. The targets must have included nobility of some sort. Otherwise, why bother attacking them and putting that level of heat on them? Scarecrows. They didn't attack the Baroness. Mm, no. I don't think so. If they were, they wouldn't have even put her in that level of danger, I think. There would have been multiple ways to do it. They wouldn't <clears throat> make a show of this. Yes, they were attacking the guards as well. <clears throat> If they wanted just to kill someone, they would have done it quietly in the night. Right, that tends to be their more specialty, usually in the elements of their advantage. There's a sense, I think, amateurness to this, at least in regards to strategy. I don't know, they were pretty coordinated. Coordinated, yes. But... Messy, in the sense they left a lot of people behind for evidence. Maybe that's the point. Well, then. So, it looks like something was recently torn down, so there might have been a need, but... Plus the amount of losses they faced, they didn't care how much they the lost. Then, yeah? no. <sighs> well, we must check to see on the docks to see if any other doc or any other skiffs are missing. The, uh, disappearances? Understood. Oh. All I saw was a puff of black smoke and then a white flash, sir. I got, <sighs> I got nothing. I was just told to drop my weapon and I just... I kept coughing and dropped my axe. Put my hands up, that's all I could do. I couldn't see shit. Oh, you know, I remember you. <sighs> Coming and going down the main streets, in and out of the side streets. They seem to be tense. And and only moments ago, you heard loud noises coming from the arena. I'm you know, not doing anything, but I think I have an idea where they are. In the scuffle. I think they're the same guys, same type of bandits who kidnapped Shakar. Wait. <sighs> Fuck. Really? Fuck. Not a lot I can it's do. It's a possibility, that. but they're not exactly subtle about what they do. Uh, not her. You seen anything? Anything? 
Those gates should definitely be sealed. What are your thoughts? Looking around the outside of the arena, you can see splotches of blood here and there where some of the guards were murdered. You saw some of the kills, both of you. Swords raised high above the head and put straight down from the shoulders into the ribcage, a guaranteed quick and usually silent kill. Several of the guards were dead before anyone realized what was going on. These... These people are good. They're not assassins. But they definitely have been doing what they've been doing for a while. And they had weird face plates. Too dull to be gold. But too bright to be anything mundane. Some sort of metal. The smell of the copper. There was smoke climbing up in the, uh, just up over the arena and then I'm starting to think you're more correct on this one, my lord. Hmm. They left people alive because they wanted it to be told. These angles, though. What do you think? Planned, definitely. They've done this short shit before. And they were uniform enough to wear similar faces. Not bandits. Mm. Agreed. Not, nothing with uh, the home. Good. Thank you, Marcus. Yeah. And they deployed their flash powder at the same time on a signal. What was that sound? It sounded like a. a ping. or a ding. or a, it could have been a gong or someone hitting something. Like a bell? Something, yeah. Maybe. Hmm. To hear that in the middle Depending of Depending on the material. It, it could be a high enough pitch. Like bronze. I want to see up where the nobles were, because that's the shit that worries me. Hmm. There were plenty of guards. Didn't even see them getting close. You should be careful moving outside the city. It's under lockdown. Hmm. Some of the people are leaving the city. You should remind them that there's a chance of being fined for coming in here. Difficult to climb quietly on an overhang like that. Looking around, you can see rivets of blood from the two nobles who had their throats slipped, rhythmically tapping on the stone below the open floorboards of the stand. Perception check, Tyler. With a 13 and a 15, your eyes spot a glint off of the opposite wall. see a piece of metal seemingly broken off in the stone of the wall. It's small, still sitting within the hole it was a part of. It's jammed in tight. It 
I'll find anything. Something lodged in the wall here. Yeah. Mm. It's fucking in there. Lodged in the wall. Have a look. As you come a little closer yourself, Sir Brooker, you know instantly what that is. You've used them before. Putting spikes. Whoever was looking to assail the people on the podium probably originally intended to stab them from beneath, unseen and unhurt. For whatever reason, they changed their plan. We include those in the <laughs> adventuring packs. Those are climbing spikes. Mm. You can dig deep into rock and you just head on up. Yeah. Or an effective tool mm. for, you know, people. Uh. Why didn't they, though? What changed them? Maybe there were too many. Um, there were more guards up here. A lot of variables here. You'd think they would go yeah. for a safer option. How long from has that been here? Is my question. Hard to tell. Perception check, Tiberius. With a 19, Could as you ask that question, out of there. you get a little closer to the hole itself. You see a bit of moisture still trapped within from some of the past day rains. This must have been here for a few days at least. Was this attack rehearsed? My lord. Hmm? This has been here for days. Days. That means they've been pra waiting and practicing for this. My theory's looking more and more, isn't it? At least so, my lord. <clears throat> Let's check above. <sighs> if they were going for the Baron, or the Baroness, they would have been able to. These, okay, they're clearly, maybe not assassins, but this was planned, thoroughly. Makes you think that the people that they wanted to kill, they did kill, right? Why would you lose the opportunity of attack on people you don't want to die? Was it though? They, it oh, seemed, by the, seems of it, they could have launched themselves and... Place the blades on everyone here. What have you seen? Found a rope hanging off the cannellation in the corner. As part of this construction, it shouldn't be here. Evidently so. <clears throat> Tight. Closer inspection, all of you will see that the rope must have moved up and down a bit in the crenellation. It's the only clean spot. The faded stone from the elements, bits of moss and grime. This rope has moved quite a bit, almost as if this is done more than once, more than twice. Frequent use. And since only the gladiators really come over here, they're the only ones to notice. They probably wouldn't have thought twice about it. I mean, a random rope? If you're mm. a gladiator and you're not really... I say this we get down anyone there. could have just climbed up here from the coast. Mm. What's the best way to get down? Without jumping. Um, the rope? Hmm... <laughs> <clears throat> It's how they got in. True. Alright. But if this is somehow... It's pretty tight with the loops, so... <laughs> I'll try to reach for you, then. <laughs> okay. Just slide down to a bit of soil that is... Don't move down. too much. No grass. It's been walked <laughs> upon plenty. Guardsman, is anything 
Hey, Search for Marco. Report. Just gotta Search make sure you're okay down here, at least. Yes, I will go grab me. him. <laughs> we have other news to report. Things missing at the docks. What? Some skiffs. What? For the Some two, skiffs. there's no further sign. Tyler, the grass is tall around this bald spot you've landed upon, but you don't see anything further. You're not a tracker in a forested area, so it makes it additionally difficult. <sighs> Outside of my area. See anyone? No. My lord. Hmm. It looks like some skiffs have gone missing from the docks. Should we check the water's edge then? Ah, oh, well, we're already here, right? Yeah. Go first, if you'd like. Um. Wait. Go through bushes and stuff. If there is a tracks here, I don't want to disturb them. Very well. My lord, should I come with or stay here? You can come down if you want. Helps have an extra pair of eyes. <clears throat> Anyone could have come from the water and just gone up here. Remind me again of that boat. Isn't that, um, a trading ship, right? Isn't that Satu? Uh, what was it called? Yes, I believe so. From what Something I'm like hearing that. Hearing about. Yeah. If the people... Perception check. ...came in via boats... Climbed up here. ...and they left into the woods. This, that's the working theory. The boats should still be here unless someone returned them, right? The attack could have happened, and they could have brought the boats over at the time. So, Halstead, Tyler, with a 9 and 7, you don't see any evidence suggesting a disembark here. Sir Brooker, with an 18, you surmise that if not here, they must have disembarked from elsewhere, but you could wind up searching the whole coastline <clears throat> just for proof of that. And all of you have somewhere to be soon. It didn't have to be here, my lord. They could have circled around from all the way across that way. It could have been from anywhere. And risk getting seen? I suppose it would be hard to climb up the rocks here. Even the pavilion down that way. It's just right there. I would There's say we could check it out, but we do have places to be. At the very least, we know how right. they got into Shall the castle, we? and we mm. can try and amend that for future. I think that's a small victory. Sounds like what I'll do is I'll have Marco come up with a list of people who've been in and out of the keep at least. Start putting some names on paper. It'll num lower the least a list of suspects. Have him send some of the more astute of investigators down to the cove, see if that's where they're going. That seems like the obvious place, but I mean, I don't know. Yeah. If they retreated Good back time. that way, then the hiding spot, wherever it is, should be more inland. Then. Agreed. Could be anywhere. It could be all the way to Cassetto or <laughs> <Could Bonnell>. <laughs> Yes. <laughs> I think we've ran this well, you, to the best of our abilities. <laughs> let's uh, let's head back. That's all right. Uh, Good try, though, guys. Of course. Thank you. <clears throat> Trying to make the best of the worst. Here I thought I was gonna have a good morning. <laughs> you must be new here. So I can strive to have a better day. That's what's important. Uh, I feel like now you just jinxed all of us, Marcus. Quit saying that. <laughs> have some positivity. This is when you say, at least it couldn't get worse. No. <laughs> no, you said it. <laughs> you, you said it. I knew you'd drag on me on that. I, I quoted it. I'm not I saying it. I, I'm fully aware that shit know, is probably going right, to get I'll terrible. write it in the book. Write it in the book. All right. Okay. All right. It couldn't get any worse if only we can only go up from here. Okay. You know, I, I feel like I hear you say that like at least once or twice a day. We can only go up from here. And, <laughs> and that infuriates me so much. So, <laughs> I'm not trying to say we're at rock bottom. I'm really not. 
<clears throat> We're pretty close. Now every morning I'll I tell myself Marcus. I'm going to become uh, oh, no. hmm. So I'm going to become I'll go and fetch a horse. I'll meet you hmm. down below. See if I can find Marco up there as well. Yeah, let him know what we found. Horses. Very well, my lord. Mm, do we need the horses if it's the uh, the mine? Ideally, <clears throat> that's it. I don't I really consider. Mm, well, maybe it's for a show of force. Horses are good. Mm. Yes, and I don't really want to walk that far. Right. <laughs> we did what we needed to to survive. Hmm. Uh, Sunbeam wasn't a tunnel horse, that's why I had to leave her behind. He's free now. Yeah, free in a rat's stomach. No, but... Not really super familiar with a lot of the bathhouse girls. Good morning. 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 I don't... Apparently it's not very good, though. No. It's the morning hug, damn it. It's still morning. Oh, you're right. I'm just gonna go inside and see if Arn's there if you wanna go ready. fucking do whatever. Yeah, I'll fuck off, you're right. still dealing with the fallout. Uh. Right, chat, I'm gonna go pee. I'll be right back. <coughs> God, I'm dying. I'm wee wee dying.
haven't said a word I'm saying. You just won't be happy. Okay. <sighs> Alright, well, I suppose we're ready. We should look up with the others. <sighs> well, we don't want to fall asleep. Men are still being assembled. Great. <clears throat> but we can take our places outside the city if you wish. Yeah, let's get out. These walls are suffocating me. Go, Sunny. Yeah, I Marcus. don't believe I've been to the iron mine before. We've crossed it many times, my lord. Remember uh, the towers stationed on the path we would usually come <clears> from <throat> that from that place in the woods. Is that the iron mine or the quarry? That is the iron mine with the towers. Oh. That's going to be fun to deal with, if we have to deal with it. I expect the robber <clears throat> baron's men not to let it go easily, to say the least. No. No, I don't. By the way, Marcus just took off ahead of all of us and is in the wrong place. He'll learn eventually. <clears throat> I checked and saw the men uh, collecting themselves at the keep. Good. <clears throat> I feel like it's been ages since I've been on just yes, a nice horse ride, you know? <clears throat> just a yeah. Just a good old. When the roads trot. were safe? Yeah. Last one we took, we were berated by orcs. And the one before oh, that yeah. was trees, I think. And the one before that was crossbows? Well, no, there's the cro no, oh, no, you're mixing oh, yeah. Up. It was crossbows and then trees. Oh. And trees. <clears throat> they all kind of blend yes. together, if I'm honest. Yeah, that one. Oh, crossbow yeah. one still hurts. Do you want to. Do you want to swap? What? Is, should you be in the center. middle? It probably. Yeah, it's a, we probably it's shouldn't a, be in the middle in the of the road either. We should. <laughs> <All right. clears throat> this would be good to get some aggression out, I think. Yeah. Uh, well, we're hoping <clears throat> for a non-violent um, approach here. Yeah? So. We are. Yeah, that would be the best way, but, I mean, do you really think they're going to hand so it over? Diplomatically smacking them down, and everything's okay, uh, right? Did you notice, by the way, my lord? Some other guardsmen, their attitude. Go on. Mm -hmm. I saw it in their eyes. Their opinion of us seems to be lessening. Yeah, what a fucking surprise. Do we have a reason this time? <clears throat> Probably when the recent activities of the Baroness would be my guess. Outside of our control. Quite. Ah, yeah. And we'll, <laughs> uh, we'll show them wrong. We'll prove it. Sounds right. We're back at square fucking one. Mm. Just be cautious, my lord, if guard openly questions your decisions in the moment. You have to put him in his place quick, quickly. 
to everything I've done for these gods. Not all of them, my lord. <laughs> Some are very strong will. There's only a hundred left. There's no way I haven't fought alongside all of them at some point. Alright. Oh. Somebody are you, stole my horse. Are you crazy frogging? <laughs> horse thief! Bum, 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 bum. Uh, uh, uh. I'll be back. <laughs> yes. <clears throat> oh. <laughs> well, those... Yeah, that happened. Um, oh. well, those other guards sound like Capitano sympathizers, you know? Who was gonna give them, like, the most money would, uh, suffice? Well, I've been doing that too, remember? <clears throat> right. <laughs> so if that was the case, <laughs> you'd think they'd be on my side <laughs> as well! You know... Maybe they just plain hate us. Because they ain't us. I remember seeing a, a tapestry of a woman yeah. riding a horse, and she's holding a stick. And as she's riding the horse at full throttle, she throws the stick in between the horse's legs, throws herself off, and then goes, Yeah. Oh, it's... <laughs> God. <laughs> How horrible. Yeah, could you imagine? They're, they're not blaming your name for everything that goes bad, right? Uh, name one that they haven't. Oh, shoot. Sure. <laughs> uh. mm. <clears throat> Tricky, isn't it? <laughs> right. We get to prove our worth all over again. Well, after a couple good acts, perhaps sooner or later, they'll be singing your praises once we've, we've done the good acts, though, Marcus. And my point in all of this is that we keep doing these, and they keep deciding, mm -hmm. nope. Yeah. Welcome back. Ah, oh, there <clears> you go. <throat> oh, I've nearly beat two people to the edge of their lives. I totally didn't get my horse back, immediately take ten feet out of the gate, and then immediately <laughs> lost my horse again. Totally didn't happen. Who's taking your horse? Yeah. Who's taking your horse? Fools. A lot of them. <laughs> yeah. <clears throat> yeah. They're the ones who probably curse the name. I'm the only air heart that matters. <laughs> the horses seem raring to go. <clears throat> Oh, yeah, so I gonna you. hold them back and every now and again. They're jumping at the bit, literally. I mean, just look at them go. <laughs> <Yes>. <laughs> there you go. They're very excited. Just a couple of lads and their horses. No, Sonny, <clears throat> no. Please. I like your discipline, Maelstrom. Because if you fucking bucked right then when everyone else is doing it, I would fall off because I'm sat like this. <laughs> yes, I would. Rolling. <laughs> you know, your horse barely eats. Nelson just looks at you. Just hear the the, sn the, the sniff of a, a sigh from its nose. <laughs> you and me, buddy. <laughs> just stays two peas in a pod. Your, your horse takes after you. They, they won't eat. <clears throat> yeah. God. Dude. It's like, is Maelstrom busy goes. all day? With what? He's got important horse matters. He's horsing around. Yeah. <laughs> <He's>... <laughs> oh, fuck's sake. Listen, he's just a stud. It's fine. <laughs> <clears throat> wow. <clears throat> it's actually kind of nice just to sit out here, you know. That just, just taken in nature now. <sighs> the sea breeze upon your face. <laughs> I 
I didn't get that in Ireland. The sea breeze. I didn't realize how much I missed it until I came back, you know? Yeah. The best we would get is the swamp breeze. Nice breeze from the swamp. There was the swamp <clears throat> and then uh, the ashes of war. Yeah, yeah. Like drift on in. Yeah. That was most of it. God. The smell of black powder. But here? This is nice. Yeah. Sea breeze blows most of that away. <clears throat> There's so much. There's so many plants, so many trees. <laughs> Like night and day. I remember when we went back to Cacovia. So many. Hmm? It was a Bedaria. No, it was Bedaria. I thought it was Bedaria, yeah. The second time we went back to Bedaria, it was just tree stumps and mud. <laughs> <clears throat> oh, hey, well, Matt. Oh yes, the elves of the wood. Another group of people that we've done a lot uh, for and threatened I how, fucking... Uh, I wonder how they're doing. Last I heard they were looking for... What was it called? Elder trees. I... I, I honestly just, could not care. I check out when they start talking most of the time. Oh, right. Especially Should now. I <clears throat> check in on them, my lord? Who? Uh, the other home in the forest. Why? I don't know. It just seems proper. You worried something's wrong? Uh, well, after all that, right? Do you know who the first people they would come to if something was wrong would be? Hmm. Us. What be you? Yeah, I know. <clears throat> oh, so we should, we should just let them come to us then, not the other way around. My point is, if something terrible was happening, we would know about it. <clears throat> okay. I don't really want to talk mm. to them either way. <laughs> 